G'day YouTube. This is just a quick overview of the latest release of Linux Mint 18.1, the Mate Desktop Edition. Now, so essentially we have Linux Mint, a Ubuntu spin-off, and in this release it uh, uses a desktop environment that's essentially a fork or a branch off of an older, simpler design that was then known as the GNOME 2 uh, 2.0 desktop interface. Now, as you can see, it's quite lightweight. It's actually a little bit like the Cinnamon interface that's default to uh, Linux Mint for most cases. But uh, moving on a little bit, it does use a different file manager as well, another slightly lightweight version. Uh, it's called Kager, I believe. There we go, Kager 1.16.1. So nice, easy, simple window manager right there to complement the desktop environment. In terms of the kernel, let's pull that up and see what we can do. Whoop. And let's see, so we should actually do uname A in the terminal and we can see with uh, this version of Linux now, it's only the kernel 4.4. So Linux Mint is known not to have the latest release of the kernels. Uh, so it might it, it's it's not quite up there with Ubuntu, but it does that for stability reasons. There is a way to override that as well somewhere in the update menu options to uh, get the latest release kernel if you really need it for hardware drivers and things of that nature as well. So uh, moving on, I've had the system monitor open here before, quite lightweight as you can see, not even using, well, just barely over a half a gigabyte of, uh, of RAM there. So definitely a lightweight interface if, uh, if, you're, if you've got some old hardware on your PC there. Uh, now you can get this in the 32 and 64 bit variety, so pretty much for most distributions or hardware pieces there. And uh, all in all, a nice lightweight alternative to the Cinnamon default Linux Mint 18.1 uh, desktop. So yeah, just a quick overview there guys, and I hope you've enjoyed. Cheers.